Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, the Killer here. Welcome back to a new video on Killerskins.com. No, on my YouTube channel. And today we want, or I want to show you how I create with Avatar my own map creator maps. Yeah, so let's get started. So first of all, what you need is Blender. Blender is important because we need the um, batch export option for Blender. We need to export in in uh, object as a batch. I will put the link into the description for this one. So the first one you can see we have the beta, the old beta Rift of League of Legends. And uh, yeah, we want to export it. First, you need to make sure it's X mirrored. Um, that means uh, if you check here, uh, I, I will select now all. Um, this here is how League of Legends maps look normally. Uh, you can see here is the Baron. And on here we have the Drake. And... We need with all avatar and uh, the mirrored version so select uh we need to select all and we need uh, to set the origin first to the origin uh to the uh, 3d cursor which makes um every cursor to this one after that you can um x mirror it it's pretty pretty easy if you do it and um, yeah after this um, only you can easily export it what I personally do is rename everything in a blender um, by this one so room one is, is uh, so room one is the first model and we want to lay load it into the uh, base um, layer so it will be like this so the layer one is the base layer which will be loaded at the start and the other layers you can see which we need also but not today uh, we do it later in the next tutorial so first if you do did this uh, you can also go with batch rename and do it in there and it, it's pretty easy I guess um, next what you need to do is a batch export everything so select all click on file export right from batch and then I need to go into beta rifts and I will create a new folder with 3d models Make sure all the models are triangulated faces and then the path mode should be copy um, so every uh, file uh, or every uh, texture file will be loaded into this folder too so we click on batch export objects it will do it Cool, take a bit. Go into the beta folder. You can see everything will be converted on here. We have also Targa, which we need to fix. Um, all the uh, images should be DDS files, so we need to um, convert or change the Chaos House 02. Um, to DDS. Uh, personally, I use XN Convert, which can be downloaded easily as free. Um, just drag and drop, and then choose DDS. And we can start. Now it's done. Now we have the house version. This one here as DDS file. Alright, so now what we do and what we get. So we got a model file, object, and the material file. In the material file, I can open it as example. 
Uh, you can see I have PNG files. Um, it's because PNG works much better than DDS in Blender. We need to convert them to DDS. So use this one. X and convert. Drag drop. And then I will also delete the original files. Boom. There we go. So everything is now on DDS. You can delete this one too. All right. Now we need to modify the material files. You can export as DDS in uh, Blender, which make it much easier. Um, but if you bake everything, uh, it will be in PNG. So yeah, what we do is we need to edit it with M editor or any other editor. I use the M editor because it works the best with a batch fox. See how fast it is. Now what we need to do is just replace um, dot png with dot dds. Um, all open file documents. Click on it. Everything will be changed. And click on save all. There we go. So everything is now saved. This could load a bit. Yeah, there we go. So everything is now on DDS format, which will load also here in the files in the uh, editor. So see, everything is loading. All right, so we made now this process. Now we go into avatar. Um, first, what we need to do is set the map name. Um, so this will be Beta Rift. Level is not is the Sunless Rift. Um, bait Light Fog will be this. Uh, this uses a cold debug. Um, it will be fixed in the later versions. Um, currently, the fog is off. Um, auto layers is set. And the pre modifier, uh, yeah, modifier alpha is on there. First, what I will need to do is click on file, open object files, go into the path, select all, and you can see 76 files are loaded in the base map. You can see on here everything is loaded. And the only thing that you need to do is click on File, Save, Map, Geo. But before we do this, we need to create the path for um, League of Legends. What I personally do is use Obsidian to create um, the uh, path. We need an asset folder and the data. And yeah. God. Up. Um, so I will open up now. Uh, right, games, League of Legends, game, data, final, maps, and map 11. I will go with ma assets, maps, kit pieces, SRX, and textures, and choose only one texture. And then data, maps, map geometry, map 11, and base SRX materials up in. Extract selected to this folder. I'll put it, create a new folder named map 11, which will be the what name. And now it will be extracted in there which is pretty easy. So map 11, assets, maps, pieces, SRX. 
But now what we need to do is change this name to Beta Rift because the map name is Beta Rift. There we go. I can see we have one texture. We can delete it. There we go. Now we go into data and delete this one. And we can copy this here because we need it. Now what I do is click on file, save a map geo and export it into um, into map 11, data, maps, map geo tree, map 11. And then I will, you need to name it base SRX, which is the um, Sunless Rift we currently use. And now we click on save. And now it should take a bit. Yeah, you can see it's now done. And you will get tons of files. The custom mats, which includes only the materials in here. You can see how much we have. And we have custom particle, which is currently not used. Uh, it will duplicate with the custom mats. Um, then we have the uh, important materials file in Python. The sun properties, which you also can change on here. And the converted bin and map geo file. Now everything is uh, done. Now we only need to copy the images to the uh, sets folder. So we go with the, the S, copy, and then sets maps, kit pieces, SRX, beta rift, and now we put it in. Yeah, there you go. Now everything is done. We don't need avatar anymore. Now we can go to LCS Manager and create a new mod. So this will be Beta Rifts. And save. Edit raw. Oh no. Uh, hold on. There we go. Select the map 11. Like the folder, and now it should do everything for you. All right, close, and now we can load it up into League of Legends. I need to do click on play. Also, make sure to go in here before starting the game and go into game and then graphics and make sure that prefer dx9 legacy mode is checked otherwise it will back the map okay with training and it's done now we can start the game uh, I would choose, of course, Callista. Callista is the best. All right. Let's see. Yeah. So you can see it loaded up. Of course, um, the map is uh, a bit buggy, but you can see it loads up. Uh, this map needs huge uh, fixes because it's an old map. And yeah, but the most of the stuff is working on here. And yeah, so that's it. Everything done. And yeah, make sure to subscribe uh, on YouTube, on social media, Twitter, Instagram, and join killerskins.com. Everything is free.
custom skins and every tutorial is there. And yeah, so bye bye.